My name is Chandra Prophet, and I'm a bone marrow donor. I am currently in the cast of The Lion King on Broadway, and I play Sarabi, Simba's mother. I became associated with Shannon Cher through Shannon Tavares, who was a member of the cast of The Lion King Broadway. She, was, she played the young Nala role in the show. Shannon was di diagnosed with leukemia and um, she lost her battle with the cancer. I actually wasn't in the show at the time that she was in the show, but I came um, shortly after. Her mother introduced me to Shannon Cher. Yeah, the first time that I actually got registered, I had volunteered for a drive um, through Shannon Shares. The process was very, very, very simple. Literally, I filled out my name and some questions on on the questionnaire, and they took something that represent that looks like a, a Q-tip, and they swabbed the inside of my mouth and put it inside of a tube, and ta-da! <laughs> that was it. <laughs> so simple, so quick. Like took less than like ten seconds. I got swabbed in 2011. And I didn't get a phone call till 2013. So when I was informed that I was a match for someone, I, um, I missed the phone call. They called me first and I missed the phone call. And then because they didn't get me on the phone, they emailed me. Oh my goodness, my, as soon as I read that email, my stomach dropped to the floor. I believe that Every great decision comes with fear. This procedure is definitely a commitment um, of time. You have to go to a lot of doctor's appointments. You have to give a lot of blood. I ended up having to take a month off of work. The great thing is that my employer was behind me 100%. I was able to stay afloat on that time off. It was not paid. First of all, it was six o'clock in the morning. It was like a team of people that I, I didn't meet prior. So then now I'm meeting like all these people and then you have the anesthesiologist, you have this ologist and this ologist and you know, all these different people. And I was just like, you know, seeing all the equipment around. We're, we're rolling into the actual operating room. Then the, the doctor's like, okay, you're gonna, I'm gonna ask you these questions and then we're gonna get started. And I'm like, okay. He's like, what's your name? And what are you here for? I was like, what? <laughs> um, my name is Chandra and bo bone marrow? Like, <laughs> am I sure this is what? But they have to ask you just to make sure that, one, you're the right person. Two, it's like the last chance, if you can't, just in case you're like, I, you know, I really can't do this. <laughs> Oof. And there goes the blood. Yeah. And how many vials do we have to do? Average is like 12, so you're a little below average. Really? Yeah. Oh, well, here we go. Good morning. Step one. Good morning. <laughs> so I'm here, I'm about to get my chest x rayed. <laughs> this is the EKG machine. I hook these up around my heart. So they can get a chest read. We're on our way to the airport. It is 
a.m. to what's today? Monday. 26. Monday the 26th. And we're headed to the airport to go to uh, get settled to donate. It, it, it was, my steps were definitely ordered, like. Yeah. Yeah. You wanna send your last one more time? All right. Bye. Bye, my dear. Yeah. <laughs> so I got it for you. Yeah, you got it for you. So I got a straw. If she wants a zipper. I got a straw. Yep. She wants a zipper. Yep. Thank you. You all right with that? I am. <laughs> Thank you. on my documentary. How's your pain right now? Any number? This is after the anesthesia. Say hi. Hi. I'm really tired. She's back. But I can go right back to sleep. So I'm in a little bit of pain. Not horrible. Not good. Going home in an hour. Oh, we get to go to the hotel. They said everything went extremely well. Better than they expected. Hallelujah. Here's the vital signs. Giving Grey's Anatomy a lot of fun and money. Spanning the room. Span out. Give me a big up. On her phone. Welcome back. Give me a big smile. Camera sent a picture. She's back. Your clothes are on the other side. I'll be right behind. You need to do a bust a move right now. I'm kidding. <laughs> I 
like the way Holly participated too. <laughs> Very good. So let me get like this, and I want you to be on your side. And this one pulls up. Okay. You're very tall. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. I wish I could have some. I don't mind. She's beautiful, isn't she? Don't focus on her, not on me, please. <laughs> you see the nice view over there while I take care of that. Oh, okay. okay. You want me on this side? It's a nice. It's because you can be distracted. <laughs> This is uh, more annoying than anything. Yeah. Did you have a good night of sleep? Um, <clears throat> for the most part, I did. I just can't stop look, look at you. Me. I can't me? Yeah. We give you a lot of fluid. Yeah. It's gonna be better. Okay. When do you think she'll have a bowel movement, or is that she had a hearty meal? So is that? Something that should be pretty normal to um, come. Otherwise, I recommend that you have the recommendation for a stool softener or something more that is not as gentle. It's a laxative. The name is Miralax over the counter. And once you take it, within 24 hours, you have it. Okay. Mm -hmm. You'd rather see? I, I can start. Yeah. Is that from the anesthesia pipe being down her throat? Yeah. It goes away, mm -hmm. but today is the first 24 hours. Right. Is there something she should do, like lemon water or something different? Tea with, with, with honey. Mm -hmm. Okay, this looks very well. Can I see? I'm going to eat. Yeah, if you want to. I don't know what I thought, but it's just this a little well, more like they are. There. I call them the vampire pricks, don't they look like that? <laughs> but it's nothing. Uh-huh, I know. I mean, it, I'm sure it's, it's something. Yeah. Here's a bigger. What you see from the outside is not what you feel. How would you say? Do you have the results of how it went? Or? So good. Yeah. Perfect. Good. It's a travel day. He look good. What do you want to do? What do you have on your agenda of things to do today? Donating bone marrow was probably the biggest and best decision I could have ever made in my life, and I would definitely do it again in a heartbeat.